forget to subscribe to the channel to stay updated on the latest news. Hello everyone and welcome to the channel. Today's video is about the practical book and how to uh, write the practicals or how to conduct the practicals. The topics that I'm going to cover are handbook instructions first thing, how to write the practical book, documents needed to be attached and experiments that were conducted one by one. There were five experiments. Let us look at the practical handbook first. So there are first thing experiments are mentioned over here. There are eight experiments. So your study center may select all eight just to explain or they will conduct any five of them and uh, on those basis only the exam will be conducted. Now let us move to the point number four that is the instruction for the learner. Practical counseling session that will be conducted by your study center and the schedule will be shared with you. This handbook link I'll be sharing in the description. So let us start with how to write the practical book. <clears throat> First thing is the notebook that we need to purchase. This is biology practical notebook. You will find it in any stationery shop. And this is you can see one side ruled. The right side will be ruled and the left side will be blank page. And it will be about 100 pages, 96 pages book that you need to purchase for the practicals. So this is the example where you can see the left hand side is a table <coughs> that is being drawn on the blank side. And the right side will be the ruled page where you will write with a pen. And left side always only pencil, no usage of pen. So moving on to the writing of the practicum notebook, you will thus record the procedure of at least five practicals. So the study center will at least explain you and conduct five practicals out of the eight. Now writing the practical notebook. This is how you are going to write. These are the points that will be covered. So this is a sample notebook from one student. Okay. Here you can see the title, aims, objectives, hypothesis and introduction. So we are just looking at these four points. Now here you can see the title is given experiment and the name of experiment but the introduction comes first and this introduction goes at least five pages you have to research this introduction from online references or any books and then comes the purpose that is the aim of the experiment and then the hypothesis. So the study center will share a particular format with you that you may need to follow or they may ask you to directly follow the, uh, the one which is given in the handbook. So then here the title comes first, then comes the aims, hypothesis and then later comes the introduction. Now after this comes your description. So here it is all different according to the study center format. So whatever is the format just follow the format and write it down. So the most important part of your practical book are the data sheets. Uh, those are given or shared by the study center which on which you will be conducting the experiment. Actually they look like somewhat this. One of your data sheet is over here. Attach the data sheet on the left hand side that is on the blank side. Whenever you mention the uh, conduct the experiment the data sheet will come there and the results will be coming next page 
wherever the analysis of results or interpretation of results is mentioned just the table or the outcome of your experiment will be written on the left hand side and all in pencil everything in pencil no pen so I have shared all the data sheets in a folder and shared the link in the description now let's move on to the documents to be attached so there will be five sheets to be attached these are the documents apart from your practical handbook inside the handbook you have to paste these sheets so the first page will be I think a blank sheet in the practical book paste this receipt on it and write all the details then there will be an index page I think because it depends on practical book to book so if there is a an index page the index page will con contain all your experiment names which page number it's on and wherever there is an index page just skip that page and on the next page paste the second sheet this is your moderator sheet to be provided by your study center sheet 3 4 and 5 are already present in the handbook that is the practicum handbook you will find these three sheets on the last pages this is the title page the certificate and the acknowledgement all these documents I have taken separately and I have kept it on the drive so you don't have to make a separate attempt to separate them out you can directly download them from the link so here you can see this evaluation process this was before the lockdown period now after lockdown everything is online and the processes are also online so a lot of things have changed according to the new guidelines you can see the interpretation has completely changed presentation of content practical report and directly the viva so this is how the distribution of marks is but i'll just explain you the older process your attendance conduction of experiment interpretation and practical notebook was given weightage then external was conduction during the exam the answer sheet of the exam and the viva so this more this was the uh, weightage given now I'll just quickly uh, take you through the list of practicals conducted in our study center the queuing on recall so these are the two list of items and you have to remember these items as given so they are random like image nation ratio nothing is related to each other now the first set of marks uh, or first set of scores you can say sorry that was given based on this list and the second set flowers the names of flowers were together the names of stationery were together the furniture were together fruits together and insects together so what we are basically doing is queuing everything we are kind of creating a group of everything so the score is very different because randomly remembering things and remembering it according to the key is very different so your scores are very high on this sheet now we go to the second experiment which is called as distraction of attention so there will be a bell ringing uh, besides you somewhere around you very close to you and in that sound you have to concentrate over here that what is the value for D in this sheet then what is the value of X and you have to write down the numbers in the below box so while the sound goes louder and louder and louder you have to complete this given sheet in a stipulated time that is somewhere around three minutes or five minutes so how much blocks you complete you will be assigning those scores yourself 
Now the next experiment is the uh, family environment scale. Now where <clears throat> this is the answer sheet, okay, and there will be questions given like uh, how was your family during your childhood, whether uh, you had a jolly family or you know you could speak in your family uh, freely there was a scope given for your opinions etc so there will be number of questions given there are 69 questions for each question you have to mark your opinion whether you agree disagree strongly agree or you're neutral so those based on this set there will be scores given for strongly agree and then you have to provide the sum the total of those scores now the next experiment is uh, general mental ability that is the gma and there will be again set of questions so you have to mark the answer over here and um, there will be kind of uh, logical questions so uh, solve uh, some mathematical question and if you know the answer there will be four options given so just like any bank test like any aptitude test this will be the answer sheet and the final scores will be over here now the bills adjustment inventory again so there will be a set of questions then you have to mark yes, no or doubtful. So each yes, no and doubtful will have own set of scores. And if you mark no, you may get four, yes, then five or something like that. And then total of the scores. So these are the data sheets that were provided by the study center and your study center may also provide these. So I have given the uh, link in the description to download these files.